So the first of this week's Moore's Millions is next end. This is Leg 8, and it's a another shorter one, I think. I think just three and a quarter miles. It's a 0 to 120. The top one is the Black Mass for John Morgan Hill, Billy Boy, David Robertson, French Foreign Legion, Darren Thompson, Sphinx Watson, Darren Howes, Oaks Dream for John Morgan, Moonlit for Carla Agante, Fenestra for Tam King. This is where the fish lives for Obi Wan, Venture to Konya and Spanish Steps for Martin Leland, Wild Prince for Doug Warren, Montoya for James, Half Hour Hancock for Stu Gray, Joala Macalette for Doug Warren, and Ball 5 for P. Hannon. So 15 then. Really interesting race. I still think these three and a quarter mile moors millions are a little bit of an anomaly, but anyway, off we go. And Oaks Dream is the leader from Moonlit in second, then Montoya third. The Black Mouse and Ball Five after that one. So they saw themselves out through the first few furlongs, and of course, again, the rain's coming down. And we're racing over three and a quarter miles, so we'll get some pull ups, I should think. Three that have gone clear are oh, two John Morgan horses and a Carla Agante one. So it's a Black Mouse, Oaks Dream, and Moonlit. And currently show the way. They're all safely over the first. There's a gap of about six lengths then. There's a pack of a bit of a shuffle. With Montoya heading the main route. Fenestra is also close up on the outside. This is where the fish lives. Is also going well. Early on, looking towards the back, where Wild Prince is just about the back marker. There's half hour Hancock. Venture to Cognac, so three commentators at the back. And they come down towards the second. And they're all safely over that one as well. And Oaks Dream and the Black Mouse. Oaks Dream in the blue cap. The Black Mouse in the yellow cap. Gap of a couple of lengths back to Moonlit. Then a gap of four to Montoya Fenestra. And this is where the fish lives. And they take the next one. And they're all safely over that one with Wild Prince continuing to be the back marker We've still got a fair old way to go and this is fence four and also for the that one as well decent jump by the back marker is seeing a little bit closer to the main pack ball five has also dropped towards the rear at this stage but there's still a long old way to go and quite a few people got two in this as well John Morgan's two are first and second at the moment, and the rest are nowhere. So there's the Black Mouse and Oaks Dream. Gap of five to Moonlit. Gap of three then to Montoya. Then this is where the fish lives on the outside of Fenestra. Joala Macalette, another grey. Oh, there's something gone. There's a fall of air. Sphinx Waltzing has gone. So Darren Howells, unlucky this week with a few of his horses. I saw two yesterday that didn't even start the race. Uh, Joana Macalette made a mistake there, so to the ball five, so it's the Black Mountain Oaks Dream from Moonlit in third. Cap then to this is where the fish lives in the yellow. And towards the back it's still Wild Prince and Ball Five at the back. But we've only lost the one so far. Mouse and Oaks Dream continue to dispute the lead then. Past the midway point now. With the Black Mouse on the outside of Oaks Dream. Moving it back in third. And this is where the fish lives. Montoya and Fenestra, three in a line. Behind them, Hillbilly Boy and French Foreign Legion. Then Joala Macalette is ahead of Adventure to Cognac and Spanish Steps as they take number 7 under something gone there half hour Hancock has gone jockey wedged in the fence as you can see so no more laughs there for half hour Hancock that's one of the most difficult horses to say despite the fact that they're three very easy words to say just the way that they though they don't go together at all from a commentating point of view unless you want to just totally drop your aces and call it half hour Hancock like we get another one pulled up at the back as well now. Might well be ball five. With the Black Mouse in the lead as they take the eighth. And over that one they go. Wild Prince just getting a little bit detached. Ball five was the one pulled up. And it's the Black Mouse and Oaks Dream who still dispute the lead. Moonlit is in third. Then Fenestra is fourth. Montour is after that one. And this is where the fish lives. And French Foreign Legion, Hillbilly Boy, and Venture to Cognac. Spanish steps a mistake there by Oaks Dream. 
has left the black mouse clear. With the black mouse clear by a couple of lengths then to Oaks Dream second, Moonlit is third, then Fenestra and Montoya. Then this is where the fish lives in French Foreign Legion, then Hillbilly Boy as they take the tenth. One is trying to get a little bit closer now, Spanish Steps, then comes Joana Macalette, Venture de Cognac, and finally Wild Prince. But they've still got just under a mile to race, and the black mouse is still the leader. With Oaks Dream now back on an even keel in second, then Moonlit Montoya, Fenestra, this is where the fish lives. And pushed along his hillbilly boy. And all right at the back who's really struggling now is Wild Prince. They've got six furlongs to go and they've got three more fences to take. And it's the Black Mouse from Oaks Dream as they take this third last, which is an open ditch. Over it they go. And it's the Black Mouse and Oaks Dream from Fenestra, Montoya, then Moonlit. This is where the fish lives. Then French Foreign Legion, Spanish Steps, Joala Macalette, Hillbilly Boy over the second last they go. And a Morgan Pair is still one and two. It's Black Mouse in the lead. Oaks Dream second. Gap then to the remainder are just about headed by Moonlit, Fenestra, Montoya. Then this is where the fish lives. Spanish Steps is after that one. But it's the Black Mouse from Oaks Dream. The Black Mouse is a good four lengths clear of stable companion Oaks Dream who's now looking to struggle. Then Montoya, Fenestra, Moonlit. This is where the fish lives. Spanish Steps has now got the inside, looking towards the back, Wild Prince is well out of contention, so too Joala Macalette, and they race down towards the final fence then there, in leg eight of the Moors Millions, and it's the Black Mouse in the lead from Oaks Dream second. Montoya is third, then Fenestra. This is where the fish lives. French Foreign Legion, Spanish Steps still trying to get into it. But it's the Black Mouse in the lead from Montoya and Oaks Dream. It's still the Black Mouse, but here comes Montoya on the outside as they race towards the final fence. This is the final fence now. The Black Mouse lands in front from Montoya second. Oaks Dream is third. Fenestra is back in fourth. Then comes Spanish Steps back in fifth. But it's the Black Mouse. He's going to try and lead pretty much all the way. Stable companion Oaks Dream is rallying for second. But it's going to be Black Mouse. This is going to be a one two for John Morgan up towards the line. It's going to be the Black Mouse it takes the leg out of the Morgs Millions. The Black Mouse wins it. Oaks Dream is second. Montoya is third. Spanish Steps run on what a steal. Fourth from Fenestra. Then French Foreign Legion. And the field will trail back to Joala Macalette. It was the last one to finish. And it's a 1-2 for John Morgan. The Black Mouse takes it. Oaks Dream was second. Montoya third for James Follish. Spanish Steps was fourth for Martin Liedemann. Fenestra for Tam King was fifth.